guys, so I wanted to do a review on something you might have seen at your local drugstore or CVS lately, and it is the new Wet n Wild Color Icon Bronzers. Um, one of these I got quite a while ago, but then these two I think are pretty new because I just saw them for the first time the other day, so I thought I'd pick them up. They are, I believe, $3.99 each, but they do go on sale quite often. So this one is one that I got a while ago. And this is Reserve Your Cabana. I know this has been out for a while, but I decided to show it because it's um, very similar to one of the other ones I just picked up. And then these two are the newest ones, at least as far as I know, because I haven't seen these at all until just recently. And this one is Shell Abrate Good Times. And it is a very dark one and then a very light bronzer. And then this one is My Shell My Belle. And it's kind of a blush and a bronzer, which is cool. So that's what that looks like. And then the Reserve Your Cabana is this one. Now these two, the main reason I want to show you Reserve Your Cabana is because these two, as you can tell, the light part, pretty much the same. This one, for some reason, is a little bit softer than this one, but they're basically the same. It's really the same thing. So if you just want a really big one like this, or if you want this one, you don't really need to buy them both. But this isn't really a bronzer, it's more like a highlight color. I like to kind of just, like on the cheekbones, place it right here, you know, down the nose, um, under your brow bones. This is a really, really, really good highlight color. Definitely not really a bronzer, and I'm very, very pale. So pretty much anything that has any bit of brown in it is a bronzer to me. This isn't even a bronzer to me. So this is a really good highlight, though. I really like it. Actually, um, Emily Noel just had this in one of her videos as a dupe for a more high-end product, so that's kind of cool. So, this is a really good highlight color. Not really a bronzer, but good highlight. And then this one is um, the one that has the same color, but also has this darker brown, which can be a bronzer or a contour powder or an eyeshadow. You know, lots of different uses for powder, but you can also use it on its own, or you can kind of swirl the colors together. And you get this really pretty kind of like bronzy shade. This would be gorgeous as an eyeshadow. So, you know, just something to think about if you want to buy both of them or not. But, um, pretty color though. And I actually would probably use this as an eyeshadow or just use this part as a highlight just since it is kind of dark for my skin. But I still really like the colors a lot. And then this one is probably my favorite. It's the My Shell My Belle. And I love this one for the pink color. It is so pretty. I will swatch it for you guys. It's just a really pretty pink. I like using this as a blush. It's very, very pretty as a blush. So, super pretty color. And then this is the bronzer part. It's not really as pigmented as you think it would be. It's kind of, as you can see, it's kind of light. And then again, you can mix the colors together to create kind of a more pinky bronzer. But overall, I really like these. I think pigmentation is really good on them. Uh, the pigmentation on this, the brown, isn't as amazing. It, it kind of pulls orange, but again, that's just for me. But I love the blush color in this. I definitely recommend it for the blush. And then I definitely recommend either of these for the highlight, just because it's a really pretty, subtle highlight. I think it would work on a lot of different skin tones. I'm very pale, and it works on me. I think something with really dark skin would look gorgeous because it would really pop. So, I mean, really something that's a good universal color, and this one has SPF 15, but for some reason these don't. But, um, really like these, so if you guys have tried them, let me know. There's also a third one, but I think it was, like, really, really dark or something, I just didn't care for it. But this is something at least new to me, because I haven't seen it in my drugstores. So if you guys have seen it or picked any up, let me know. If you guys are planning on getting any, let me know in the comments down below, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!